So in December, we kicked off a new project called Kata Containers. And today, to tell us about the progress that that community has made, as well as some of the ways that you can get involved this week, is Amy Leland in Wangshu. Thank you, Lauren, and morning. Uh, now, this is the first summit for Kata Containers. Kata Containers is a project for virtualized container. And it used the virtualized technology for the container isolation instead of uh, the namespaces. Uh, we, in Kata Containers, we make, the, make it have the, both the speed of containers and, and the secure of VMs. No, in a single house, uh, the traditional containers share the same OS kernel. Well, for in kind of containers, each container could have their independent kernels. And, and in kind of containers, we, make, we try to make the VM become lightweight. So uh, we can launch the, launch the application in container uh, in less than one second, just like the traditional containers. You don't, you don't need to pay much the VM tax for the, for the Kata container. And on the other hand, the, the Kata container is a real VM. That means uh, the hardware, hardware, uh, hardware, the device passed through, and the heterogeneous kernels, and other accelerating technologies developed for the traditional VMs that uh, apply, could be applied to the Kata containers as well. And the Kata containers uh, come from uh, the two projects developed by Intel and Hyper.sh, and the Clear Container and RunV. In, uh, in last December, after the Sydney summit, uh, we, we, we merged the two, two projects into Kata containers to help the users, to help the users adopting the technology. And in the past half, half a year, um, we, we're working together with other participants of the project to merge the features into Kata containers. And now, your turn. Amy. <laughs> Thank you, Xu. Uh, we're really excited today because uh, this week we're actually um, releasing our 1.0 release, which means that you know, we've merged these two technology code bases. Um, you know, the team's been working really hard to bring this to fruition, so we're excited that 1.0 is happening this week. And we're really excited to bring it to you here today because we're excited for your contribution. So um, there's a bunch of opportunities for you to get involved. Uh, we do first want to say a special thank you to the architecture committee. Uh, they've been working really hard on 1.0, and uh, as well as the many contributors that contributed to Kata containers um, in making 1.0 happen. So as I said, uh, we have a bunch of opportunities for you to get involved this week. And get your hands dirty, understand the technology, uh, go deep, and, and really start uh, learning about this community, engaging with our teams, and, and contributing code. Uh, Tuesday through Thursday, we actually have a full container infrastructure track, which there's multiple sessions on Kata containers. Uh, Tuesday, I think Jonathan already mentioned that there's going to be a, a container a keynote on Kata containers, and, uh, and that's with Eric, Ernst, and Anne, and they're going to be showing a really cool uh, Kata containers 1.0 demo. Uh, and then on Thursday afternoon, there's going to be a contributor onboarding session. Again, you know, we've gotten this far in 1.0, and we really are looking for code contributions and, and to build a community around Kata containers and find out things that we haven't solved, right? Um, there's, there's these new features that we've done so far, and there's so much more that we can go and do. And then Tuesday through Thursday, again, there's uh, demos within the Intel booth and then the OpenStack Foundation lounge. There's multiple demos as well. So we invite you to come check out the demos, get your hands dirty, uh, and learn about the technology and contribute with us. Thank you.